Item number SCP-6254, Object Class Euclid, Special Containment Procedures. SCP-6254 is presently kept in the standard humanoid containment chamber at Site 44's S Wing and is to be fed twice daily. Investigation into the origin of SCP-6254 by the Department of Mythology and Folkloristics is ongoing. Description SCP-6254 is a bipedal entity possessing humanoid and canine characteristics. While testing has revealed SCP-6254's hair and teeth are identical to that of Canis Lupus, Grey Wolf. Its eyes are genetically human. SCP-6254 stands at 225 centimeters in height and is not currently believed to be sapient. The subject is docile and friendly towards Foundation staff, generally behaving in a manner similar to domestic dogs. While omnivorous, SCP-6254 has exhibited particular fondness for human-intended foods, such as pizza and hamburgers. SCP-6254 was recovered outside the city of White Lake, Michigan in 1978, after two civilians reported encountering a dog-like humanoid while hunting rabbit in a nearby forest. Notably, at the time of recovery, SCP-6254 was wearing tainted clothing comprised of torn jeans and a polo shirt, as well as a broken Rolex watch. Additionally, two bullet wounds were found in the subject's shoulder and chest cavity, respectively. The entity responded well to foundation treatment, and both wounds were observed to heal at an unusually rapid rate. Since SCP-6254's discovery, the Foundation Department of Mythology and Folkloristics have been studying hypocritical accounts of a creature matching SCP-6254's description. These reports were centralized primarily in the Great Lakes region of the United States with the earliest such accounts inherited from the American Secure Containment Initiative Foundation Precursor Organization, active in North America between 1797 and 1900. Dating back to 1887, while precise details vary, this entity is typically characterized as hostile. Most sources identify the creature as consistently attacking once per decade during the first full moon in years ending in seven. While SCP-6254 has heretofore exhibited no such behavior, at the request of Project Director Arthur Day, SCP-6254 is to be closely monitored throughout the month of January 1987, and the entity has once been fitted with a tracking collar. Addendum, on January 14th, 1987, at 12.35 Eastern Standard Time, SCP-6254 demanifested from its containment cell. Recovery efforts were initially unsuccessful, and its tracking collar was found to be unresponsive at all 120 hours. Roland Baines, a resident of Wilkeshire, Wisconsin, contacted emergency services. Baines claimed to have been violently accosted by a humanoid entity matching SCP-6254's description, which had forced its way into his home. This call was intercepted by Foundation operators, and Mobile Task Force Psi-12 Animal Control was dispatched to investigate. Despite agents conducting a thorough search of Bane's residence, neither he nor SCP-6254 could be located. While investigating the garage, Agents encountered a naked human male, physically in its late thirties, who was wearing what was later confirmed to be SCP-6254's tracking collar. The individual was observed stroking and feeding an elderly bloodhound, which exhibited signs of malnourishment and internal injuries. Subject was subsequently identified as 48-year-old Douglas Brown, a resident of White Lake, Michigan, Brown, who had previously owned and operated a Greyhound racing track in his hometown, 
was reported missing in January of 1977. Whilst under investigation for suspected animal mistreatment, notably, Mr. Brown did not appear to have aged following his disappearance a decade prior, and exhibited no memory of the previous ten years. His request to keep Bain's Greyhound was denied, and he has since been released from Foundation custody and assigned a new identity. The current whereabouts of Roland Baines remains unknown following his disappearance. Several further SCP-6254 sightings have been reported in Wilkesha and surrounding counties, though thus far all attempts at retrieval have ended in failure. Kind of reclassification is pending.